Okay, Katie, so uh -huh. did you make any New Year's resolutions you gotta stick to? Not really. Not really? I mean, I feel like all the basic stuff, drink more water, work out. Right, I'm just right. so busy. I mean, we've got our new graphics. I'm in the middle of moving. I mean, I'm February You don't have 1st. anything on your February plate. February 1st, what? I'm coming for my new <laughs> life, okay? Resolution. I'll start fresh in the new month, okay? There you go. <laughs> a little busy right now. <laughs> We're tracking a fairly quiet start to our day this morning, which is honestly really nice. You're going to appreciate this after we go over these next couple of days. We've got some busy days ahead of us. Live look right now over in Mount Vernon. Not much going on. Traffic running pretty steadily. Uh, really just worrying about some of those cold temperatures. We're somewhere in the 30s. We're barely above freezing. Some of us, of course, more so than others. We're still a bit warmer down into the boot hill. A bit cooler if you travel up towards Mount Vernon. But we've got a breeze out of the north, and that's making it feel a lot cooler. So this looks a lot more like what we were feeling yesterday with those mid to upper 20s. Some of us feeling closer to freezing, but still... It's a bitter cold start to our morning. You're going to have a tough time getting out of bed. I know I did. We've got some sunshine sticking around with us, which is always really nice when those temperatures kind of struggle to get above those upper 30s, low 40s. Winds are out of the north early this morning, which is, again, why it's so chilly out. It's going to kind of cut through you, but at least it shifts out of the east, so things are a bit more bearable by this evening. Today is going to be pretty much the last day for quite some time. You're going to see that low threat tracker. It's quiet. It's a bit on the cool side, but really as far as January goes, today is really not that bad. Rain is returning late tomorrow evening into Saturday. That's disturbance number one I want you to be weather aware of. Disturbance number two coming in Monday and Tuesday with that second active pattern both actually bringing the potential for a wintry mix along with it. So a lot going on. We've got some rain working through off the east coast there, so uh, really shouldn't be much of an issue. That's just going to continue into the Atlantic. We've got some clouds and some rain off to the west. That's our next system. That's actually going to be bringing us rain as we go into our Friday afternoon and evening. Bit of a mix when it first gets here. Temperatures are still a bit on the warmer side. We'll continue to track that rain as we go through the rest of Friday and Saturday. Maybe a little bit of rain on Sunday. Overall, this first system should be fairly low impact. Really not expecting a big snow event, not expecting severe weather. It's just going to be some rain, so it might damper some of your weekend plans. This next one, this is a late Monday, early Tuesday. You can already see we've got some of those heavier pockets of rain. We've got that stronger mixing line and some deeper colors there as far as snow goes. This one also, we're just not seeing the potential there for severe, so that's really good. But this could be a record surface low pressure, meaning it's going to be incredibly windy as we go into Monday and Tuesday. Behind it, conditions are cooler, and that's exactly why we're seeing those snow chances possible. If you're a snow lover, you're itching for some snow, I'm telling you the best chance of that is going to be late Tuesday after that system passes through. We can easily pick up maybe four inches of rain between pretty much now and next Friday. And honestly, not the worst thing in the world. The rain's always really nice to have this time of the year. Storm Track 3 up, really nice to have. Take radar on the go, and you're going to be using a lot of radar these next couple of days. Sunny today, partly cloudy. We've got rain working its way in late this week and then into the weekend. Best shot of rain is coming in on Tuesday. It's also going to be the best shot of some snow we could possibly see. What did you say our accumulation totals could be? Um, for rain, about yeah, four inches. Four inches. We well, you know we could week. really use it. I can't tell you the last time it rained. It's been a while. Yeah, it has. Well, I'm kind of looking forward to it, actually. Yeah. Thanks, Katie. All right. Well, coming up, have you